Hi guys, so here we have another problem. It says, find lines that are tangent and normal to the curve at a given point. So here we need to find the implicit differentiation because that will give me the slope of the line. So how do I do it? Well, let's go ahead and do the derivative. This is just going to be 2x plus. Now here I have x and y, so I'm going to do the product rule. The derivative of x is just 1 times y plus the derivative of y, remember, I don't know it, so I'm going to call it y prime, times x minus, and then I'm going to do the derivative of y squared. Well, you're going to go ahead and do 2y times y prime equals 2, the derivative of 1 is just 0. Beautiful. Now that I'm here, I'm going to go ahead and just solve for y prime. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to move everything that does not have a 1 prime to the other side. So I have 1 prime x minus 2y times y prime equals, and I'm going to move this to x, negative 2x minus y. Then let's simplify this, and I have x minus 2y equals negative 2x minus y. Finally... I'm going to move all this that is multiplying to the bottom dividing. So negative 2x minus y over x minus 2y. Now I can go ahead and plug the value for x1 and the value for y3. So let's do it. Because remember, the derivative, which is what we just found, dy over dx, which is the same as y prime, is just the slope of the line. So I'm going to do negative 2 times 1 minus 3 over 1 minus 2 times 3. And this is going to be negative 5 over 1 minus 6, which is also going to be negative 5. And the slope is going to be 1. Now, very important, for the tangent, you just keep the same slope. So m equals 1, and then I have the point 1, 3, and I just need to find the line. So I just do y minus y1 equals x times x minus 1, and I'm sorry, this is m. So I just plug the rest, and I get my answer, which is equals to negative 1 plus 3, finally y equals x plus 2. Now, for the normal, I'm going to do the exact same thing. But remember, the normal is going to be the perpendicular slope of 1, which in this case is going to be negative 1. And then I just do the same procedure. y minus 3 equals negative 1 times x minus 1. Finally, y equals, and I'm just simplifying here. And I get that y equals negative x plus 4. So I have the tangent right here and I have the normal right here. And that's it. Please don't forget to watch our other videos. Also remember, you can Skype with us. And also, thanks so much for learning.